Hi, everybody. Welcome to Writer's Workshop. It's our very first Writer's Workshop of the year, so I'm very excited. Before we get started, we need to make sure we're ready to learn, as always. So eyes watching, ears listening, quiet as a mouse, and still like a pretzel. So um, before we get into our actual lesson and our new unit, I want to briefly talk about what Writer's Workshop is and the way it works. So um, the first part is called the mini lesson, and that's when we all get together and we learn something new for the day. It's only about five or ten minutes. And then after that, you have a chance to go back to your desks and um, write on your own for about 20 or 25 minutes. It really depends on the day. And then at the end of Writer's Workshop, we try to get back together and quickly um, review what we learned for the day and also have a couple people share their work. So that is Writer's Workshop in a nutshell. I also wanted to briefly talk about why writers write because um, we haven't talked about it yet this year. So writers write because they love to, because they want to share their thoughts and experiences with other people. They write because they want, they have questions they want to ask or because they're going to teach somebody something that they know. Um, we are going to write about something different. We're going to write about our opinions. Okay, so our new unit is called um, persuasive writing. And when you persuade somebody, you try to convince somebody that your opinion is the best opinion to have. Okay. Now, before we can go about sharing our opinions, we need to quickly review the difference between a fact and an opinion. Okay. So that is today's lesson. We've talked about it earlier this year, but we're just going to review it to get us um, set for the unit. So a fact is something that is always true. Always, 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 always. A fact can be proven. So you can prove it through your observations by actually seeing it for yourself. Or you can prove a fact by doing research, by um, looking it up on the computer or looking it up in books that have been published. So here's an example of a fact. Okay, um, cows produce milk. Well, you guys can read all about that in books or here you can actually see this gentleman milking a cow. Here's another fact. Spiders have eight legs. Well, you can count them right here, okay? And you can look it up on the internet or in books um, having to do with arachnids. An opinion, on the other hand, is something you think or you feel, okay? It's true for you, but maybe not true for everyone. An opinion cannot be proven. Your opinion might be different from somebody else's opinion. So here you see Mrs. Underwood and I thinking and imagining about ice cream, and I'm thinking, mmm, yeah, this waffle cone fudge covered sprinkled deliciousness is definitely the best ice cream to have. And Mrs. Underwood over here is going, no, this triple layer berry flavored sherbet is definitely the best to have, okay? So your opinion may be different from somebody else's. Here's some examples of opinions. So um, pepperoni is the best kind of pizza. Well, I might think that, but Mrs. Underwood might say, no, sausage and peppers is the best kind of pizza. Here's another. Winter is a beautiful season. Well, again, Mrs. Underwood might think winter is a beautiful season, but I might say, uh-uh, no, thank you. I do not like winter at all, okay? So if you want to know something, if something is a fact, or an opinion, you need to ask yourself three questions. Is it always true? Is it true for everyone? And can it be proven? If you answered yes to all three, it's a fact. But remember, our writing unit is gonna be all about sharing our opinions. 
our own thoughts and feelings. So here you have uh, these six people having all sorts of their own opinions. They all are thinking something different. Okay, that's what we're gonna write about. So now it is your turn to uh, practice sorting facts from opinions. Remember, you can sort facts from opinions just like we do here. Uh, Mrs. Underwood and I are in a heated debate probably about that ice cream flavor. And remember, a fact is always true and can be proven. An opinion is what you think or feel and it cannot be proven. Okay, my friends, I will see you next time. Bye.